Hey ladies and gentlemen, Wolf Cryer here and welcome to my tutorial on how to stream to multiple platforms simultaneously. So I'm assuming since you're at this video, you want to grow your audience and what better way to do that than by branching out? I mean, why limit yourself to just streaming to Twitch or YouTube or Hitbox or any of those streaming services when you can stream to multiple services at the same time? So the best way that I've found to do this is this website known as Restream.io. The first thing you're going to want to do is create an account once you get to this website. Now this is my dashboard. So my channels are already present, but let me go ahead and click the add channel just to show you all the platforms that are available to you using this website. You can stream to Beam, Twitch, YouTube Gaming. Pretty much for YouTube, you're going to be using YouTube Stream Now. And Twitch, those are the two that I run on. But you can also stream to Ustream, Azubu, Hitbox, Mob Crush, all of that. It has a ton of services that you could actually connect to and stream all at the same time. So when you're adding a new channel, you're going to click on it. For me, I've already got it here. You can actually pay $4.99 a month to double your channel and create a second YouTube account that it's attached to. Now, once you do this, it doesn't show up because mine are all set up, but you are going to need your stream keys for each service. So I needed to add my Twitch stream key and my YouTube live stream key. And you enter this information into it and you turn them both on and now you are connected with both Twitch and YouTube. And once those are both connected, you are going to open up your OBS and you are going to change your settings. You click on settings, your broadcast settings, and you are going to change this streaming service to custom instead of Twitch or YouTube, wherever you were streaming to. And then you are going to copy this here and paste that right in. And you are going to copy your stream key, which we will block that out. And you are going to paste that right in as well and apply. And there you go. Now you are set up. And pretty much what this does is when you start streaming on OBS, it is going to send this stream to Restream.io, which is then going to restream those back out to the two or three or four platforms that you want to stream to. It is very, very easy to set up. Now, another cool thing is the titles tab, which is in beta right now. This works only for Beam, Hitbox, Twitch, and YouTube, but you can actually type the title right here and update all, and it'll update all four of those at the same time to change the name of your stream. Now, you can also click the social alerts button and connect your Twitter or Facebook account, and when you do so, you can create a text message down here. Hey, I'm live right now. And every time you stream, it'll automatically send those messages out to your Facebook account or your Twitter account or both simultaneously. So you would not have to personally go to each one of these sites or accounts and post that you are now live. Restream.io would do that automatically for you, which is pretty cool. Next up is the chat. Restream actually allows you to view all your chat in one big chat box, allowing you to customize it and actually display it directly onto your stream. We're gonna go ahead and show you that right now. Normally you would click the download app, download it and get it going, but I already have it, ladies and gentlemen. So we're going to bring this right over here. I keep this on my second monitor so I can read chat while I'm streaming. But that's what the chat window looks like. You can change the size of this. This does overlap anything that you have on the screen. So you can actually go in and change the appearance. You can enable transparency of the background. You can even make it look like it's not there except for the words for the most part. Now this will let me know that I am live on both Twitch and YouTube and I am currently in both channels. 
and it also gives me a live view count of both combined and I can click this and see what each one is at for view count which is also pretty cool you can change the appearance like I said change the opacity all that type of stuff you can actually set notifications to play a sound file when there's a new message over there so if you're kind of new you don't have many viewers and you want to make sure you catch those viewers when they pop up you can have it play a soft sound or something like that to notify you that somebody typed to you you can also set it to where it will notify you if your nickname is mentioned or you can have it notify you if certain words are used in the message that the person has left for you on your chat now the next major thing is you can embed this chat in your stream itself you will need the CLR browser plugin for OBS but once you have that that's the same browser that you would use for twitch alerts and that type of thing and then you can mess with the settings as far as background opacity chat background opacity and the scale of it but pretty much all you would do here is bring this up and create a new add CLR browser and chat one because I already have it in there so pretty much all you would do then is take this here and copy it all paste that right there there it is once that's on there your chat box is going to show up right there and as you can see very small but the chat is ready to display messages sorry about that guys and there you have it and then you can move this you can shrink it down you can do all that type of things and in the settings itself over here you can change the background opacity so now the background's darker or lighter or gone which is pretty cool so that is pretty much the fast and easy way to set yourself up to stream to multiple platforms simultaneously and give your viewers notifications when you go live and put your chat from both twitch and youtube or whatever service you are using all right on your screen while you are streaming it's pretty cool awesome to interact with multiple channels i talk to my twitch people my youtube people all in one compact little chat box off to the side i stream to both it lets me know who's watching me where how many people are watching me total I mean it's very very good website to use and the best part ladies and gentlemen it is currently free I do not know if this is a website that is going to maintain that free status or not who knows but it is nice and easy boom it did not take me long to set this up at all probably a total of 10 to 15 minutes total from start to finish and I love streaming to YouTube and Twitch. I have followers over on Twitch, and I have all my subs on YouTube, so why not stream to both? Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for checking out this tutorial. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Guys, let me know in the comments what you think, and thank you so very much. Peace.